nearly 40% of the neurological diseases are due to the brain stroke. Brain stroke causes significant amount of disability, but it is still preventable. Over the years, what we have realized is there is an area of the brain which loses its blood supply and the time is brain. Every minute about 100 million neurons will disappear because of the lack of blood supply. Brain constantly needs oxygen and glucose that comes through blood supply only. Whenever blood supply is stopped because of the brain stroke, the central part wherever there is no blood supply undergoes complete damage and that will definitely result in neurological deficits. The type of neurological deficits depends upon the brain area that got affected. Most important thing is what we realized is the surrounding area of the brain there is decreased blood flow. These brain cells are electrically silent that means they are not working but they are capable of doing chemical activity. So in that specific window period wherein the chemical activity persists, if we can restore the blood flow, they become electrically active once again. So that area is called penumbra and that is the time gap wherein they can be reactivated is called window period. Now this window period is about three to four and a half hours wherein if the person comes to the stroke center, we can give some specialized medicine to dissolve the blood clot and re-establish the blood flow so that we can minimize the area of brain damage, reactivate the number of cells which have become silent. The ultimate outcome of the treatment for the stroke entirely depends upon the number of neurons that are viable at the end of the day and we can reactivate them, reconnect them to the rest of the brain so that they become functionally active once again. That's how we can reduce the degree of disability and also save the life.